In this demo, we'll show you how Fortisim empowers the identity threat detection and response framework. In this use case, Forti Recon acts as an early warning detection system to proactively find any publicly leaked credentials from darknet and other related sources. Fortisim leverages the Fortinet fabric or REST API channel to gather alerts from Forti Recon. Subsequently, Fortisim uses real-time monitoring, event correlation rules, identity location dashboard, and a watch list to identify any potential identity threats. Upon threat detection, Fortisim initiates a response by blocking the IP address in 48 using watch list and disabling the user account in the Active Directory. After logging into Fortisim and checking the incident tab, search for Forti Recon. I found a corresponding incident which indicates the user Anna's credentials had been leaked. The information available only included user Anna. To gain more visibility, I navigate to dashboard page. As mentioned earlier, the identity location dashboard will provide the user identity and location information. Here, I am filtering for user Anna. The results that appear suspicious login activity from multiple countries. Since we confirmed that user Anna's credentials were used to log in from multiple geographic locations, to prevent this, navigating to resource tab, then rules, and select the leaked credential event rule, and going to action tab, and click watch list. Here, Fortisim offers lookup IP by user function to populate a dynamic watch list tracking user to IP mappings within the identity location database. This function automatically updates the watch list with the user's latest IP address and removes the old one. Now, I will show you the configured threat actor watch list populated with the latest IP address using the lookup IP by user function. Let's switch to FortiGate to demonstrate how this threat actor dynamic watch list is integrated. Navigate to the security fabric and click on the external connectors. Here you will see the threat feeds I have already configured, which display the latest IP address. Within the firewall policy, you can define this threat feed and block those IP address. After taking action against the IP address, I return to Incident tab and select Explorer view. Type in user Anna. Let's take a deeper look at how Fortisim correlates events in real time and prioritize the identity risk. We can see two key incidents. Medium incident, VPN logon from outside the defined countries and a sudden location change for user Anna marked as high severity. To remediate the incident, return to the incident view and click on the 40 recon alert. Here, you can run a remediation playbook to disable the user account in the Active Directory. This is how Fortisim helps in implementing the ITDR framework by offering seamless integration, advanced detection, and efficient response method. Thanks for watching.